seen as an enormous. Uh, still definitely talented. And Wildfire is a Robin player. Uh, I think, yeah, we're going to see Robin off the jump. Another New England base. I want to believe CT is the same. But yeah, Wildfire is definitely a really good Robin. Okay. And we're, we're seeing a lot of lasers. Back not Robin. Robin having the Levit Sword, definitely one of the strongest tools. And right there, we're seeing it just doing massive damage. It's like a smash attack in the air. Literally air smashes. You know, it's funny in uh, Rivals of Aether, there's a character that has that, and it's Raster, who's modeled after Falco. <laughs> so we've got the air smash and the inspiration for the other air smash guy. Oh, the drag oh. down? Yeah, but I don't believe. Like, I don't know if it's ever guaranteed Nair up tilt. I think it is sometimes, but it depends on the hit of the Nair you get. And you have to, like, yeah. get it perfect or else that's not going to happen. And Wildfire knowing just to hold block bank on um, Mage messing up the combo just because of an unfavorable drag down. Yeah, definitely got, like, it felt like they got the wrong hit of drag down. It's a bit too fast. All right, Wildfire with stage control now. Despite the percent disadvantage, Black 11 score is back online, though. We're seeing oh, probably a misinput there on that yeah. side B. Definitely. Don't know what they were going for, but definitely wasn't that. Oh, that and just yeah. failing to recover from that distance. So unfortunate. Like all these little weird situations that niche characters like Robin can put you in. Uh, unfortunate, but still going to respond immediately. Mage back on the board here. Dead even game. We got the weak down air, but no combo off of it. Yeah, that there ceiling the top. Oh, in the turnaround. So far at zero. Uh oh, the up tilt sneaking underneath the aerial. And now we've got a chance for Mage to get some combos going. This is where Falco thrives when he's in advantage, when he has a hit going. I mean, obviously, you could say that about any character, but just the degree to which Falco can capitalize is huge. Yeah, he, he puts you into the vortex, man. There you go. Jump lift off stage. What's the angle going to be? Oh, gets away from the back air. All right, Wildfire here to stay, at least for now. But that yeah. was the good drag down hit for Mage, and now we see this Vortex continue. Oh, and just getting hit by that sword. And again, Mage has to be wary of Robin's sword. Not going to be on the board right there, but going off stage with the fair. And he used the sword to throw a Wildfire, too. That was crazy. Wildfire looking probably for a roll in or a jump with um, the down smash, but Mage just going all the way over that. And Wildfire is now try trying to catch the dash back that we see from Mage. All right, forward air getting it started. Pushing to the edge, okay. And the snipes, I'm loving Mage's snipes with a single laser, just as like an edge guard setup or something to force out a jump. Gonna get back to stage, play it safe. Look for a ledge trap, and yeah, it's second jump on stage. That Falco can blow that up with forward air in most cases. Oh, snipe right there. Uh, that okay. was a call on that. Yeah, for sure. This is still very, very close. I mean, Robin does a lot of damage. Just naturally with strong hits, but also off some combos, too. Yeah, they, they're definitely a damage hitting machine. Yeah, I think Falco's really good with the um, the Reflector in this matchup. Obviously, it comes out so fast. I think it's the fastest Reflector in the game. And you've got those guaranteed combos. Robin not going to be safe from that, even at that percent. Up tilt, bear, mage taking game one. Pretty yeah. convincing with JV2. Yeah, it was a JV2. And, but that was, I would put to note, like, Fal one of Falco's better stages. So, let's yeah, see the color on what Wildfire is going to choose. Yeah, I'm kind of surprised Wildfire let it go to Battlefield for game one. That's just, like, such a, um, a notably strong stage for Falco, being able to keep his combos going a little longer. Yeah. But when I was seeing the stage switch, uh, I don't think Wildfire has another character, from my knowledge. 
even though having a Robin icon right there. Yeah, right? Like, I feel like this is a stage pick more than a character pick. Robin, just like how we were saying for Greninja in Wasabi's earlier set, one of those, like, specialist characters that you kind of have to just put all of your time into to make it really worth it. Like, the ceiling is very high for them, but, um, you know, as a result, you need to dedicate. I feel like Robin mains just like Robin a lot, too. It's a, a pretty common thing. Yeah, they definitely no, you're not do. playing the character to, to be uh, top tier. <laughs> no, that's not why you main them. It's a, it's my probably favorite fire. I'm okay. Oh my god, falling up here, getting so much damage. Oh, like the... the... Sorry, go ahead. I was gonna say it's akin to like Mark falling up here. Yeah, very much so. Oh, and man, these guys are schmixing each other. There's so much damage in just the first 30 seconds. Mage looking to get rid of that stock too. Oh. Spot dodge the Nair, still got up tilt, and then bam, the frame trap in the air as well, ending with back air. Mage looking like he might be on some uh, some super momentum right now. Yeah. Okay, jumping out the corner right there, smart of Mage. And slowing the game down, using the laser to control the pace. Laser plug reflector. This seems so annoying for Robin. Wow, jumping in with that full hop, descending, landing, air dodge. Mage just gonna slip in to find the jab. I'm really liking some of the baits here. And common theme we've seen from these Fabos from Kofi for Mage that they're just going damn off stage oh. and living that. Oh, just, oh Mage! Oh Give me a break, bro! That was magical, dude. That was just beautiful to see. Yeah. That was really like merely us. He just found so many cool ways to keep that going from the shine to the landing fair to- Oh! Relax! This is for charity, bro! Like, chill! Of course, these players want to win no matter what the situation is. So, Mage showing the true heart of a competitor here. It doesn't matter what kind of tournament it is. You're in it to win it. Yeah, definitely. If he's, he's definitely in it for the clip, man. Oh, the parry again. Mage has been on point with these. Oh, another one. Knowing that Sword Care just loves swinging back, and Jesus Christ off the side B. Another back air kill, and Mage is going to advance 2 0 here over Wildfire. Very well played the whole way, honestly. Yeah, and that was for top eight loser side. Yep. All right. And that leaves just one more qualifier for you and I, Reggie. That All is right. going to be Wasabi versus Stretch. And, and it's great that we're ending it off on like a New York boy. Yes. And a Lucina. Hey, yeah. I'm right at home. All right. Looks like neither of them are here in the lobby just yet. So, um, of course, they'll be on their way soon. Uh, for a little bit of background on the players, at least the one that I can certainly inform you on would be Stretch. We talked about him a couple minutes ago before that set. Staten Island Lucina player, one of the strongest in the borough, uh, had a kill.